The Premier has told Labor's state conference on the Gold Coast she wants to overhaul workplace laws. The Palaszczuk government will consider increasing penalties for injuries and deaths at work, prompted by the deaths of two workers at Eagle Farm earlier this month. A minute silence for the tragedies of the past week. To show our respect. With party leader Bill Shorten in town, the focus soon turned to politics and the LNP. If the best thing on Tim Nichols' CV is that I was Campbell Newman's treasurer... <laughs> Ms Palaszczuk's mind was on two construction workers killed at Eagle Farm earlier this month when she announced an overhaul of workplace health and safety processes. The audit will consider whether existing penalties are enough or should be strengthened to include a new offence for gross negligence causing death. Every worker and their family has the right to expect to return home safe. With the next election due in 18 months, Ms Palaszczuk talked to jobs and highlighted what she saw as the party's successes. Let me tell you, come the next election, I need a majority government. It was a deliberate move to hold this conference on the Gold Coast despite having no Labor MPs here. The party is desperate to break the LNP stronghold and today called for candidates. The opposition is readying for a fight. There are deep divisions within the Palaszczuk government. A heated exchange occurred when the left and right argued over whether some senators should be forced to base themselves in regional Queensland. I don't normally swear in public... At a Excuse me, I come to... from Mount Isa branch. If you read the amendment, you Excuse are reading... You were speaking to the resume, amendment. Resume your seat. Let me just tell you just something, Sonny. Kathy, we're not going to have randoms jumping up and making comments. The conference ends tomorrow. Leonie Mellor, ABC News, Gold Coast.